going to attempt to land the space shuttle Atlantis using use the landing preparation scenario and as soon as it starts up I'm going to set the time acceleration to 0.1x so that I can start an MFD because you just don't have much time to do anything with the scenario has you fallen out of the sky pretty quickly okay so let me bring up glide slope and let me bring up my webcam and let me record so that I can look at the playback afterwards just to see how horrible my landing was okay that's recording all right now I want to select Cape Canaveral runway 33 And I believe this is what I want. I think that's the HAC. Okay, so here we go. Switching over to atmospheric controls. Basically what I'm trying to do is keep that velocity vector right toward the runway and then watch the HAC to give me an idea if I'm getting lined up or not. And on the right I believe it also gives me an indicator if I'm descending at the proper rate or not but I don't actually know how to read that. I guess I should be constantly descending at 20 degrees or 20 degree down pitch so if I'm understanding that correctly I'm too high at the moment I probably am a little high because I tend to keep coming in fast on these landings. But I sure feel like I'm stretching myself to get over there.
brake, landing gear. Three hundred. Two hundred. One hundred. Fifty. Forty. Thirty. Twenty. Ten. Yeah, I feel like I slammed the runway pretty hard. I got the brakes on full. Trying not to run off the end of the runway. Wheel stop. All right. Now, let me look at the playback and see how good or poorly I did. Playback. skip ahead here to the end because all I'm really interested in is the actual touchdown everything else seemed to go pretty well down, air brake. That wasn't too bad. 